Hi, Chris here from ED Armadeso. Uh, thank you for attending today's two minute tip. Today we're going to talk about using the clipboard tool to help us when we're doing those complex surface selections. So if you imagine doing a simulation, a thermal simulation maybe of uh, something like this impeller, uh, you may want to apply a thermal boundary condition to these uh, leading edge surfaces and to do that you might want to create a name selection. So the process would be to go through the model, holding the control key down, selecting the surfaces that you require for the name selection. As you can see, going through like this, uh, zooming in, rotating the model. And invariably you make a mistake like that. I've lost the selection there, I've made a mistake. So let's go back and start again. Select the surfaces, zoom in, select surfaces. And at a suitable point through my selection process, I can go in here to the clipboard tool and add the current selection to the clipboard. It acts as a buffer. So if I make a mistake now, I've already got those surfaces saved. So I'll continue going through my model. As I said, manipulating the view, rotating, zoom, zooming while holding down the control key. At another suitable point, add to the clipboard. Again, continue the selection. Going through another suitable point, add to the clipboard again. Zoom into this last section here. Select the surfaces, add to the clipboard again. And if I make a mistake, oops, I forgot to hold down the control key. I can just go back in and recover the selection from the last save to the clipboard. So I can do select items in the clipboard and I haven't lost the old selection. Just got the last surface to do so you can see those are the surfaces selected, just to make sure, add them all to the clipboard. And now I can go away and create my name selection uh, to apply my boundary conditions, recover the surfaces from the clipboard, click apply, and there I've got my name selection selected uh, for use for applying thermal boundary conditions. Okay, so that's using the clipboard in those complex uh, surface selections when you rotate in the model. So thank you for attending today's two minute tip.